Hi, I'm Tom Wishon, and I wanted to tell you a little bit about Wishon Golf's newest group of fairway wood and hybrid models with high COR, um, high ball speed uh, face design on them. The 927HS and the 797 hybrid HS, HS standing for high strength steel. Do you remember one of the things that I've been most proud of in my career of designing club heads is that way back in 2004, I was the first person to design a high COR face fairway wood. And the year after that, 2005, the first to design a high COR face hybrid head. After those first models um, that came out with a high COR face, we I was able to design several different ones and be able to, to improve the designs each time. The very first high COR face fairway wood that I designed, the 515 GRT, back in 2004, was a fairly tall face fairway wood. And of course, as you know, that's something that attacks the confidence level of an awful lot of golfers. So over the years, I was able to modify with different forms of high strength steel, different forms of heat treatment, shapes of the face and all that to where we were able to design high COR woods with more of a semi shallow 30, 31, 32 millimeter face height on that. So the 927, you know, are a 31 to 32 millimeter face height, low center of gravity. They look good sitting low behind the ball. They, they give you the confidence that you're going to be able to get the shot up and out, you know, off of tight lies with that. We created it with a little bit more of a pear-shaped head in the shape of the 927 fairway wood. It's going to be done in three, four, five, and seven. And the lofts that we've done on these are in two degree increments, 15 for the three, 17 for the four wood, 19 degrees for the five wood, 21 degrees for the seven wood. Okay, what this means is that we're aiming this for fitting as a two fairway wood set, primarily for golfers. So in other words, for higher club head speed players who are more proficient, a little bit better ball striker, the three and five wood. Okay, at that point, you're looking at 15 and 19 degrees. For players with a little bit slower club head speed, aren't quite as proficient with their ball striking skills, then we recommend that two fairway wood set being a four and seven. Four wood at 17, seven wood at 21 degrees. But the key element with the 927 is something that I started to get into a few years ago, and that was I wanted to give club makers and golfers the ability to make and use shorter length fairway woods than what the industry was pushing out on them as standard. You know, for a long time, I've really railed against, you know, longer length woods, drivers included. You know, I'm totally against the 45 to 46 inch driver length. And what's problematic with that is that with that came a standard three wood length of 43 and a half for a lot of companies or even 43 inches. For the vast majority of golfers trying to hit a 15 degree fairway wood off the deck at 43 or 43 and a half inches long is a very difficult thing to do. And so I wanted to be able to, to offer the capability of allowing club anchor to fit golfers with say a three wood length of 42 or 41 and a half if necessary, you know, with this and the other woods shorter than what their standard equivalents have always been. Well, the only way you can do that to be able to build shorter length woods and get them to normal ranges of swing weight is to be able to add a lot of weight to the head. So a key element of the 927 fairway wood will be three weight bores. One in the hosel, the usual nine gram weight bore maximum down at the base of the hosel below the shafting bore, and two more on the back and the toe that are on the sole of the head. These are covered by a brand new pentagonal shaped medallion. So this is something that you're going to have to get used to is a little different. You know, for years and years, every medallion that has been used by Wish on Golf to cover a weight bore has been the little oval shaped medallion with the TW logo on top of it. So when you get your head and it comes to you and you see these little pentagonal five-sided things right here, those are medallions that are put in, you know, when the head is shriek-wrapped and shipped from the factory. They are loose, 
and they will then come right out of the head once you unpack the kit with that. So don't lose them. Okay, Diamond Golf will stock extras if you lose them or if you have one damaged or if you need to take one out to replace, you know, to change the weight in a head, for example. So you have twin weight boards on the sole, each one capable of taking up to nine grams, a nine gram hosel weight board. You can add 27 grams in total to the weight of every one of these 927 fairway woods and corresponding 797 fairway wood heads with that. Again, that's going to let you build fairway woods and hybrids to shorter lengths because shorter lengths are much easier to control. If the golfer is you know, going to ask the question, well, what if I go to a shorter length fairway wood, am I gonna lose distance, okay? Changes, you know, changes like that we've seen in testing and for a few years of doing this already, no, you're not probably because when you're playing with a wood that's a little bit too long for you, most of the time you're not going to be hitting a dead center. You're going to be hitting it off center, which means you're going to be losing ball speed. So as you go shorter and you hit it more on center, you're going to be finding that you're not really going to be losing distance. The other thing is the vast majority of golfers, if they swing a 43 inch three wood, and then they swing a 42 inch three wood, their club head speeds are virtually going to be the same. Now, if you swing 43 versus 40 and a half, okay, you're gonna lose a little bit of club head speed, but the difference is you're gonna be a lot more consistent with that. So 927, high COR face to keep the smash factor up there very high and give you maximum ball speed. You know, semi shallow face height, to make it very easy and give you confidence to get the ball well up off tight lies. The, the fairway woods in three, four, five, seven, the seven, nine, seven hybrids in a three, a four, and a five hybrid with that. Again, the hybrid is made with a Wish on Golf's 335 bore to accept our range of S2S hybrid shafts with 335 tip but they could be bored out to 370 if you want to use a conventional 370 tip shaft in the 797 hybrids. 927 Woods, 797 hybrids, brand new from Wishung Golf. Thank you very much.